Hey guys, I'm Gamer Mate, welcome back to a new video. So I'm here back inside Roblox Studio. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own piggy type traps inside Roblox Studio. So if you go over to this trap and step in it, then you can see if I can't walk or jump. If you have to 5 seconds, then you can see if the trap disappeared, and then I can walk and jump again. So let's get into the video. So the first thing you need to do is add in a part. So this will be our trap. If you want, you can add in a mesh or customise it to what it look like whatever you want. Also make sure it's anchored, and then I'm just going to be resizing it. So once we have our trap, I'm actually just going to add a mesh to it to make it look a bit better. Here we go, so here is our trap. If you click on it, inside of Explorer, and then rename it to Trap. And inside this trap, you can click Plus, add in a script. And inside the script, we can remove Print Hello World, and then type in script dot parent dot touched connect then two brackets then function two more brackets and then between these two brackets we can type in hit then go down and then a new end should appear with a bracket then in between these two lines we can type in if hit and hit dot parent find first child Bracket speech marks, and then type in humanoid with a capital H. And outside those brackets, we can type in then, go down, a new end should appear, and then if you type in hit dot parent dot humanoid dot walk speed equals to zero, then go down, type in hit dot parent dot humanoid dot jump power then equals to zero then if we add in weight then I'm going to be waiting five seconds before the trap disappears so wait five go down then if we just copy paste these lines here copy paste then if we change the numbers so zero on walk speed is going to be 16 and then on jump power this is going to be 50 then the last thing we're going to be doing is going down and then typing in script dot parent and then colon destroy and then two brackets then this should be your script done you can also change these traps to be anything you want so you can make it so the player can jump higher or walk faster or anything like that so if you just close off script click play so once we've loaded in and then step on the trap then you can see I can't walk or jump we have to 5 seconds then the trap should disappear then I'll be able to walk and jump again so guys that's going to be it for today's video if this video helped make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe down below in the description you can check out my Roblox group and discord server and I'll see you later bye